um, we're obviously talking a, a bit about monkeypox while we're here. Um, I don't know how much work you're doing on this already. Um, perhaps you could give us some insight as to, to what threat you see from this disease and how a business like yours can help. I think in, in general we are doing comparatively little on uh, cont on contagious disease. Uh, we, we, we now have a vaccine division which is basically COVID oriented and, and uh, also protecting a vulnerable part of the population with antibody treatments and things like that. Uh, but I know very little about um, monkeypox here so I, I think I'll pass a little on, on commenting that. I hear Seth Berkeley and everyone else being quite concerned. But yeah, yeah, uh, no, Well, that's fair enough. I think we're all learning together on this one at the moment. What, what was interesting about what Seth Berkeley was saying is he, he just doesn't feel that um, governments are embracing the lessons of the COVID crisis very well. And actually, there's a, a, a general complacency about taking on board one the emergency response and how it should be tailored and two actually dealing with the fact that we're still in a crisis in some parts of the world which would, would you agree with that analysis yeah. I think th there are actually quite definite lessons from the pandemic that I think we need to apply yet again and sort of not lose them in, in history uh, and I think that's especially to do when it comes to speed and scale uh, you remember we made 2.9 billion doses of, of COVID vaccine in a very short while at no profit. And, and the real reason to do all of that was we, we, we know that we have the ability to scale up. It was actually Oxford University that came uh, with the original academic uh, setup for that. But we know how to scale and we know how to do that in over 180 countries. So I think those are lessons. But to be able to do that, then you need to be able to have government funding up front. The Americans have that. The Europeans are now discussing on how to put that in. I'm not sure that that's happening right now, and I think perhaps it should, uh, if monkeypox is, is as problematic. Uh, and then I think in, in overall, lots of cooperation needs to be put in place. Making vaccines is one thing. Making sure that they end up in people's arms in distribution uh, is another one, as we have learned. So. Yes, I think there are definite lessons from the COVID pandemic that, that we should take to heart. Are we ready for the next pandemic? Um, we saw run-ins between AstraZeneca and the Commission. We saw um, strange rancor, despite it shouldn't have been that way, because everyone was working in the same direction. Everyone wanted the same thing. But are we ready for the next pandemic? Because sure, if it's not monkeypox, there will be another one, or at least that's what a lot of the experts in your area believe. Absolutely. There, there will be another one. And we don't know what it will be, and we don't know how to uh, how to deal with it if we can build, for example, a new vaccine, etc. But I think it's important to recognise that if we use the lessons that we had from COVID-19, then we should be smarter, quicker, less costly uh, than what we had to do in, in COVID-19. More cohesion between governors and governments and, and, and corporates. Absolutely, you can say infectious disease, like we're talking about here. There is nothing that individual companies can do and there is nothing that individual governments can do uh, or for that matter with academia that is better than working together and try to get our act together. That means crossing barriers that we don't sometimes always cross. Which barriers? Well, uh, the ability to, for example, funding in, yeah. the, in the way uh, that is needed, quick funding even for science. Uh, academic. Uh, we work a lot with, with uh, academic universities in, in normal disease, but suddenly there is something that needs to be done at three, four or five times the speed. Yeah. Um, those, those are barriers that we learned a lot about and that we know how to do.